In just a couple of minutes, this will become my home away from home. This has to be one of my favourite camper trailers. The Cruiser High Rise. It's perfect for a family, a couple, or even by yourself. I've taken them to the Gulf, Cape York, and what the best part is, is the footprint. The way it sits is all the room that you need, so it's easy to pick a nice little camp spot. Now that I'm all settled in, I'm going to give you a walkthrough, but I'm going to do that sitting, I think, because it's beautiful out here in the sun. Up the front, you've got a fully off-road polyblock hitch, and that's connected to a 120 by 50 by 4 millimetre thick drawbar. It's going to take you anywhere. You've also got your handbrake so the trailer won't roll away in the middle of the night when you're sleeping. And on top of that, you've got your gas, all plumbed up, ready to go. Gas bottle holders, jerry can holders, you've got your Anderson plug, heavy duty stone guard. Also on this side, you have your fridge slide. You can fit up to a 110 litre fridge in there, depending on the model. And next to that, you have your storage compartment. You can get to your poles from both sides and you also have a slide out drawer that you can use as a pantry. Then you move into the stainless steel kitchen where you have a four burner Thetford stove. You also have running water, pressure pump, quick connect gas and quick connect water. Plenty of drawers for your cutlery and your utensils and just to top it off, at each end you've got LED lighting to light up your whole kitchen. Around the back you've got two brand new tyres on alloy rims. You also have two recovery points which is really good for pulling you out of trouble and you've got high intensity LED lights so no one will run up the back of you. Around the other side of the trailer you have plenty more storage where you might keep your fishing gear or your recovery gear. It has drawers, all pinch seals on the doors. You also have your 12 volt switchboard. Now that feeds you three 100 amp hour batteries, feeds all your 12 volt outlets that are scattered all around the trailer, controls your water pump and you also have your lockable water filler, which gives you peace of mind when you're out of camp because you don't know what people might get up to while you're away fishing. Underneath the trailer, you have a 100 by 50 by 4 millimeter Super Gal chassis. Now, Super Gal means that it's galvanized inside and out, so you've got protection on the inside of the chassis as well as the outside. Set over that, you've got your independent suspension, which is double shock coil over suspension with your 12 inch electric brakes. You have a 110 litre food grade stainless steel water tank with a bash plate for protection. We've also put four legs around the trailer for stabilisation. Most people only put two, so you can shore this trailer up properly. But now that it's starting to rain, let's go inside where it's dry and have a look in there. Now that I'm inside and I'm out of the inclement weather, I can talk to you a bit about the canvas. It's going to keep me dry all night. It's close weave, 15 ounce canvas, and the water just beads off it. You've also got the midgy mesh, and I'm around mangroves here, so that's important as well. This area here is awesome. So I've got the table here now, and the couches. But this also turns back into a double bed. And you've also got the double bed up there, which is an inner spring mattress. So that's good for mum and dad. Down here's a perfect setup for the kids. Here is a step, it's also a lockable box, so that's good for securing items like your wallet, phone, other things like that while you might be away from the camper. Underneath me here is the battery charger which hooks up to your 15 amp inlet on the outside so you don't have to open up your camper to charge your three 100 amp hour batteries. Each camper also comes with three 1 metre high intensity LED strip lights with a five metre lead and a waterproof switch. So you can plug them into any of the 12 volt outlets scattered around the camper. All the carpet in here is marine grade carpet, so it's gonna last you a lifetime. The windows have canvas on the inside and the outside, so you don't have to leave the comfort of your camper to close it up at night. And you can leave the outside open, so when you wanna let air in or light in, you just undo the zips on the inside and you're gonna stay nice and warm and dry. Geez, I hope this weather clears up soon because I've got to get out there and catch dinner. With the Cruiser High Rise Camper Trailer, you and your family can be confident that you're going to get a product that's going to last you a lifetime. There is no timber in this structure, but some other companies are still using timber. Once you get out to the front room here, you have so many options. You can have just the awning, the skirt, the floor, a wall each end, a front wall, and then the whole thing is complete. It's so diversified. You can change it up 
you can get out there, create some awesome memories with your family, and of course, the most of all, escape with confidence. As per usual, they're not really biting. Hey mate, hey mate, did you order a pizza? Sure did mate, it's been a while ago, what took you so long? That's a 180k drive out here, so it's 20 bucks for the pizza, 30 bucks for the travel, 50 bucks boys mate. 50 bucks, oh, do I know you from somewhere mate? Nah mate, not me. You play for the donkeys? 